Hello everybody and welcome to more RimWorld! Who'd have thunk it that I'll play more RimWorld, hmm? Oh wait, everybody did. But hi everybody, good to see ya, welcome, welcome. This is RimWorld 1.0 and we're gonna be doing something a little different. If you've been watching the stream, you know what that is. I have uh, since then actually tweaked the scenario a little bit, but not too much. So uh, yeah, uh, what are what what are we doing? What are we doing, FG? So we're gonna be playing obviously a new colony. We're gonna be playing lightly modded. I'll put a lot mod list down in the description below. Um, probably, well, hopefully today. Hopefully today. Let's say it that way. Hopefully, I'll put a mod list down there today. Um, if not, I'll, I'll definitely do it tomorrow, uh, in the morning before the stream starts and all that good stuff. So what are we going to do, be doing? We're going to be playing a special scenario that I have come up with that is called the Protectorate. Because, you know, everybody's going to be doing like crash landed and is going to go for the, for the, for the ship and all that stuff. And, and I was like, nah, no, nah, we're going to do something else. Something that's going to keep us occupied for a very long time. Um... If we succeed so what is the protectorate basically let me read you the story uh, let me read you the introduction really it's an introduction to this entire thing so let me read you that and uh, I think I think that that's gonna make everything a lot clearer you were sent by the government of your glitter world to secure this world on the rim. Unfortunately, your spaceship was hit by a pirate attack while entering the atmosphere. Most of your soldiers and all of your armor were lost along with your interplanetary communication equipment. You have no way of contacting your superiors, so you decide to press on with the mission and con convince others to join your cause. So we're going to be starting with the new arrivals. We're going to be starting with three people. So, so far, so good. It's basically crash landed. Not quite though, because... um. Everyone is going to start with crypto sleep sickness. Not that that matters that much, but it feels a little bit more realistic because, you know, we get like shot down, you crash land. Um, we're not going to be starting with any metal. We're not going to be starting with any components. Not really. We're going to be starting with silver, some food, some medicine, three charge rifles. So that's the that's the big change because, you know, they're from the glitter world. They're all soldiers. They had their they had their side on. So the, glitter, the charge rifle with them, they didn't have the super OP glitter world tech that that people dream about in their in their sleep you know didn't have that that on them just a just a quote-unquote simple charge rifles no armor no nothing um they're gonna be wearing the standard clothing you know so uh um the synth red t-shirt and, and and pants that everybody else wears, uh, wears and then the map will be scattered with 12 ship chunks um i just realized i forgot to actually update the text when you actually load into the game but that should be fine. Not that it matters much. So this this makes it, this the, the the charge rifle will raise your will raise your wealth a little bit. So if you're playing this on Randy, you might get quite crazy attacks relatively quickly. But we took out the pet and all that stuff, so it should should balance it out a little bit. But it's probably gonna be you're probably gonna get a little bit more um, yeah you no know, rougher attacks on Randy uh, a little bit more quickly on Cassandra. It's because it, because Cassandra obviously scales. It should be fine for a while. Um, basically, the goal is with this to wipe out all of the pirates on this world and make everybody friendly towards us. Basically, make everybody an ally toward us. Uh, wipe out the pirates and uh, establish bases around the planet. I have set the limit to five uh, bases maximum, so we need to space them out evenly. But uh, that's basically going to be the the idea to do that just space out the bases wipe out the pan uh, all of the pirates so if the last pirate base falls that's that's gonna be the win scenario for us um so we're gonna be doing cassandra uh we're not gonna be doing merciless no 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 because we'd we'd be dead immediately uh we're probably gonna do rough i think i think rough is okay um you know, that's that should be rough should be okay. Reload any time just because I've got some mods and sometimes stuff just will break. You know, just you know how it is. Sometimes stuff will just break. Um, obviously, we're gonna need the entire planet generated, uh, and we're gonna call it the Protectorate. Is gonna be the seed as well, and we're gonna go from there. All right, generate that planet should be done relatively quickly. It's been um, generating the planet has been fairly quick for my rig. Luckily, yay to the new CPU. Well, it's not so new anymore, is it? It's been it's been out for a while, but 
or out for a while. I've had it for a while, but that that makes it relatively quickly. So we just need to wait a little bit longer. Do 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 do. Please don't uh, copyright that. I should be fine. I hummed it. I didn't actually play the music, so we'll be fine. But you know, just in case, please don't. Please don't. I don't think they will. There we go. There we go. <laughs> right next to the dead herring ocean. You know. If the ocean is full of dead herring, is that does that mean does that mean it's it there is lots of um the salt content is really high, you know like the Dead Sea, something like that. All right, there's a lot of pirate bases. There is a lot of pirate bases around. Not so many down here, but there's there's a lot of pirate bases. <laughs> We've got who do we have? The Civil Outlander Union is called Heus. Uh, the rough outlander union is Finan, or Finan rather, sorry. Uh, the neutral tribe is the Choco Kanla of the Boulder. The hostile one is the Purple Dove Kamla, and then the pirates are the greatest spoilers. And uh, we're going to be wiping those out. So we're gonna go somewhere... This would be, if we go here, that would be lovely, but yeah, getting out of this area is gonna be rough. So I might just go, like, down here? Because I do like me some boreal forest. We could do boreal forest down here and then just spread out from here. Have two over here and then two go the other way uh, eventually. Luckily, oh god no, there's, I was going to say luckily there's actually no, but no, there's just one in the ice sheet, okay. So basically what we need to do is we'll, we'll, we need to get like our caravanning stuff set up. We need to get transport parts. We need to, you know, we need to get our weapon stuff up. So, um... Most of the mods I have are are either uh, just, you know, add, they add animals or animal varieties. Uh, I've got Cucumber Stone Tweaks on. I do have a couple that, that add a little bit of stuff. I've got the Fuse mod, just so I don't have to worry about stupid, um, you know, Zid events. And then uh, we've got EPOE on External Prosthetics and Organ Engineering. Granite and Green Marble. So this is, this is Cucumber's... Um, the coupon pairs, the, the stone color tweaks, so they they add a few more um, variations. Ooh, marble and blue. Why is that? Oh, marble and green, man. Oh, green, marble and green marble. Let's see. I, I would love to have blue granite because the blue granite is pretty, is really, really pretty, but there's only mountainous ones. Um, the road is up there. There is a road down here with small hills, but it's just granite and slate. Um... Limestone, mm. marble, blue, granite, and granite. Large hills next to a road. That one's good. I like that one. We can we can move quickly. We can move more quickly on the road, obviously. So so this is a good starting area. Um, we're gonna keep it on a normal setting because if we'll have if we end up with five bases later on, that would probably go very very badly. So. Ooh. I mean, looking at this, he could just be a permanent researcher at night. He's also good, a good shot. He could just be a researcher and just do researching at night. So he's going to get the plus 16 night owl mood bonus. Which is going to go set off the, the, the depressive. And... Um, the nervous should be okay. Yeah, yeah, if we put him on constant night, 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 night owl duty, he should be fine. All right. Let's see, you got giggles with oh, good good medical though. Can't do social cooking, firefighting, or mining though. So this would be a crafter. I'm not sure if we're gonna keep her. I'm not sure, not sure if we're gonna keep her. Cause I mean this is nice. Both of these stats are nice. Definitely. But we kinda need constructing people and whatnot. Um Psychically Death, yeah, see he can't even do medical at all. You're good social, good plant work. With a passion, but nah, we're gonna reroll both of those. And let's let's see. Hard worker kind, but you can't fight. You're addicted. Hard worker but sickly. But you're good at mining and shooting and you like animals. Alright, Lev is in. Lev the sheriff is in. Let's see. David, fast learner and tough. Ooh. Those are some very, very sexy traits, I have to say. Um he is only a foreign construction. Oh she, sorry. Um she is only a foreign construction, but she is a fast learner and she's got a passion in it. So, and she can go to crafting. 
Because you can do... Uh, you can do a little bit of plants. You can do a little bit of plants. You can do a little bit of plants. Uh, well, actually, it's gonna be you, isn't it? You can't do plants. You can, technically. She's just not gonna be good at it. But if we train all of them up in plants, we should be okay. We've got good crafting. Yeah, cooking cooking and plant work is the, is the stuff that we'll have a little bit of an issue with. But um, we could even put him on cooking, because he's gonna learn it relatively quickly. Um, we can put both of these actually on cooking. Have a nighttime cook and a daytime cook. So you can do cooking, then he can do plant work, and then he can do uh, um, intellectual at night, or night owl, and you can do, oh yeah, that's that's okay, that's okay. In construction, she'll learn that really, really quickly, because, you know, passion without pl fast learner. Got good shooting. Got relatively good melee, actually, as well. The medical is a bit meh, but we'll just have to, we'll just have to deal. I'll just have to deal. So it's gonna say the 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 standard, you know, crash landed text, and you know, the three of you awaken your cryptic sarcophagi to the sounds of sirens and ripping metal. You barely get to the escape pods before the ship is thrown apart. Sometimes later you land here. Um, but I mean, in the end, you know, that's actually kind of that kind of works. That actually does kind of work because that is sort of what's happening. All right. First things first. What you can see immediately is the re. There's the tweaked colors. Because I really like them. I really like the the the, the marble and the blue granite is also really pretty. And if you contrast them, oh, it's gonna be it's gonna look so pretty. It's gonna look so pretty. It's gonna look so pretty. Trust me. All right, all right. This is ooh ooh. Okay, we've got some insects down here. That is not so good. Um, and then that's that. So that's probably an ancient danger. Ooh, this will be nice and protected. Well, obviously, we'd have to deal with the water, but this is just marsh, so we could always use bridges for a little bit. We can we can close this off here, and then we have there's only a way, only one way they can really get in, and we can use the marsh to our advantage because because walk speed is going to be only thirty percent. So we could we could we could wall this up, put a door in here. Actually, wall this up, put a door in here, and then just use this. We could go in here. Oops. Uh yeah, we'll just have to be careful with this because this is going to give us insects if we're not careful. Yeah, I like this. Okay, so first things first, we're going to mark all the ship chunks that we can see for deconstruction. Going to land. There we go. Larry, Lev, and David. Grab those. So as you can see, I have a stack mod on because, oh god, I, I, I can't do, I tried. Can't deal with vanilla stacking anymore. Can't. Can't. I just don't want to waste that much space. That much space. Uh, that much space on a, on on a. Uh, what's the word? What is the word? On on storage. There we go. Storage was the word. Storage was the word. Okay, that's gonna be rice. Um, should just have a ginormous rice field, really, and then we'll do. We don't have an animal yet, but we'll probably get some animals sooner or later. So I'm gonna do some hay grass. This is going to be rice. Can't do hair root yet, so uh, screw that. And then we're going to plan this out. I I have this 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 love of doing eleven by eleven rooms for my starting co like for my starting area, and I think we might be able to get away with like doing this. We'll have to see though. If I do an eleven by eleven here, it's not gonna fit, is it? But we could do we could do um not an eleven by eleven, but we could do a five by eleven. Two, three, four, five by eleven. Just a freezer in here. Um mine this out a little bit and then vent our air conditioning this way to freeze stuff, and then we don't have to worry about it ever getting attacked. Now we can just do an eleven by eleven kitchen area thingy here. So we don't have to worry about the geothermal because that is going to be here. So that's going to be quote unquote in the way. Um, yeah, I think that's a good idea. So so these colors are just are just that. They're just color. They don't do anything differently. They they just they have the same stats as everything else, as as in as the normal walls. They just have different colors. So it's it's just a different look mod. And I really like I really like the contrast from the blue to the white. It's really nice. That is really really nice so we're gonna do that i'm gonna have a stockpile here and i'll put a roof on the stockpile pretty much immediately so we don't have to worry about that we need to check here now we can for now 
actually safely mine this bit out. And uh, you are doing that. David is deconstructing. Let's assign these things. Let's put let's put them on four for now. Obviously, we don't want them to to actually do that, but for now we'll do that. You can do the handling eventually. Who was our night owl? Was that Larry? Larry, are you a night owl? Yes. Also, as you can see, we have a rim HUD on because I don't want to live without it anymore. I love it. <laughs> I just love it. It's the best. Okay, Larry is going to work at night. Larry is going to sleep during the day. There we go. I'm going to set that up. I don't actually need to do that like that, do I? Uh, we'll do anything here as well, and then we'll just copy that. Okay. New lovers already. Jesus Christ. Okay. Uh, the first thing that happened. Jesus Christ. Oh. Goodness gracious. Okay. Leth flirted with David by telling a tale about birthdays. Hi. Hey. Hey there. When I have my birthday, I just I, I just say I'm 30 and I'm plus four levels, you know. You know yeah, I'm 30 plus four. Um, I was trying to make a joke there and I was failing. Oh, well. David responded well. There's now Lev's lover. Mm, okay, so we need to get uh, two... Only two beds for now, right? Two double beds. And I just realized I didn't put quality builder on. Oh, boy. I probably will amend that because that's going to suck. Having to be rebuild things. It doesn't It doesn't quite matter that much, but I'll, it just means I have to rebuild a lot of stuff. Uh, I have to rebuild a lot, a lot of stuff. To get good quality things. Oh well, that's my that's my fault, so to speak. That is my fault, and I'll just have to deal with it now. Okay, Larry is getting us some things there. Okay, uh, so Larry was the nighttime person, so you can cook too. Yeah, he was a level two, but he's gonna be a nighttime cook. Um, you're gonna be a constructy dude. You're gonna do mining after that. Hunt, hunt, hunt on all of you. Um, do I want you to help with plants? Yeah, I do want to help. Yeah, you. I do want you to help with the plants. You're gonna be doing crafting after that. Uh, do some cleaning and then research. For now, for now, this is all gonna be changing later on. But for now, this is what we need. Um, okay. So Larry and Lev, because because obviously the thing is right now we don't really start with anything. So we have to, um, since we don't start with anything, like wood or, or steel or stuff, we have to get this now. So we have enough to make some beds. Um, so we have enough for one bed. Who is our biggest, con okay, David. David, I know you really want to sleep. I know you really, really, really want to sleep. I really know you want to sleep, but... You can at least have a bed like that. Yeah, and David, yeah, and David, so... Let's see. Normal bed. Okay, I'm accept. That is, that is acceptable. All right. So David and Le Lev. Okay, David and Lev. I need to remember that. I n I never play with like the normal names, unless I play by myself. Um. Okay, and Lev, you can also have a bed for now. There you go. You can go and sleep. Look at that. Look at that. Getting things done. How about that? How about that? At least they're sharing a bed, so they're going to be happy about that. Yeah, opinion of my lover, quite comfortable. Yeah, kept slept with the cold, slept with the, ate without a table, obviously. is a war crime, is a war crime. We all know that. Eating without a table is a war crime. So that is just not acceptable. Ooh, is that a, is that a, ooh, that is a, ooh. That is not good. All right, we need that then. All right, granite blocks. Um, granite wall. Let me go. Do that one. Oh boy, what are you hunting? You are going for something there. Oh, chipmunk. Okay. So yeah, I'm playing with Animal Collaboration Project. So that's why we just have different, more, more animals. This is more of a variety. So yeah, we're going to put a put a wall in there so we can't get insects in there. Because nope, thank you. No, thank you is what I say to that. No animals. No animals. I, I guess we can have some tripping hazards in here for now. To slow down attackers if they come through this way. So we'll put, put some chunks in there. For now. We'll, we'll need to close this off relatively quickly in this as well. 
We'll probably get Zappas through here eventually because this is not closed off. Is that a hedgehog? Oh, yeah, that is the hedgehog. Oh, they're so cute. Oh, Larry. Oh, Larry got an awful bed, though. Yeah, Larry needs a new bed. But the first thing that we're going to make now, as my nose itches, oh, silly nose, is a table. And that hedgehog just ate our food. Great. Thanks. Thanks. That's very, very helpful. There we go. Prioritize that soaring area. Just get me some more wood, Lev. How much do we have? Oh, 289. Actually, we have quite enough. Oh, well. Oh, well, oh, well, oh, well, oh, well. We'll just have to deal with it. Um, a normal chair. Okay, good, 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 good. Um, that's the last time you'll have to eat without a table. Unless this is a very, very ter terrible table. No, it is not. Okay, and then try it. Give me, give me another bed if you can can you can you work on the bed that'd be super cool oh god she's super slow because i just told her to to cut plants obviously she's going to be super slow doing that and these are not even fully great oh god are you eating another oh god that's a kiwi a kiwi just ate her meals damn it i need a i need to look those away quickly how much do we have 27 okay so what we'll do is definitely close this off Come on, come on. You can you can do it, David. I believe in you. You can do it. You can totally build a good bed, I believe. See, there you go. All right. So this is going to be Larry's bed. There we go. So he's... Because obviously an awful bed is not going to give them a comfort bonus. And I want to... Since we don't have a... Since we don't have a... Um, you know, we don't have a roof. We don't have walls. We don't... We want to make them as quite as, as comfortable as possible. And it just, you know, the, the, the additional mood buzz bonus there from just being comfortable is at least enough to, for now, to negate a little bit of the slept in the cold bonus or the bonus malice. It's obviously not a bonus. Not a bonus. That's not how it works. Okay. Cool. Cool. That's, that's good for now. That's good for now. Yeah. Oh my god, they're eating all of the food. Okay, screw this. You're eating all my food. You get to die now. And then we'll do that one. Um, as you can see, I have drafted hunt. So that means I have the allow tool. The modded allow tool. Just because it will give us additional things that we can do. Like, you know, cut all blighted plants and stuff like that. Because they are really annoying and horrible. There we go. Two normal dining chairs, a good table. Two normal beds. And that awful bed we're not even going to talk about anymore. How about we just don't even mention it? That's probably the best idea that we've had in a while. All right, we're gonna do a cooler like this. This is gonna be unroofed forever, so that should be enough. And we don't 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 think for a cooler this size we need more than that really. Um, could you haul? Oh, you don't do hauling. Oh, I see. Okay. Larry, why are you still awake, Larry? It's three o'clock. Oh, wait, is Larry a, a night owl quick sleep? No, he's not. Huh, interesting. Thought for a second he was maybe a night owl quick sleeper because those can mess your schedule up a little bit sometimes, but no, he's not. Can you clean, though? Oh, you don't also don't do cleaning. I just kind of want the, the, the rock rubble in there. Not a, not. It doesn't really matter. It really doesn't matter if there's rock rubble there or not, but I kind of want it cleaned. Visitors, all right, all right, all right, all right. We do not have hospitality installed, so only vanilla, vanilla visitors for now. Um, there we go. Ah, oh, look at that. Look, it's so pretty. Like these, these colors are so pretty. The good thing about the, the, the white marble is that you can actually see stuff, which is really nice. You can actually see what's going on. So that's kind of lovely. Um, I would like to get more chairs. I think. So we're going to get two more chairs, and then the next thing that we're going to do is a research bench. We need to rearrange our bed, uh, our room a little bit. For now, we're going to just plonk it here, I think. That's a good idea. And then we'll... Can we... Yes, we can. We can mark all of those for chopping. Because Larry can, can focus on these. Because we'll try and put a roof over this. And obviously, all we, we all know now, you cannot grow... Um, trees under a roof anymore so that's not working they're leaving oh they left us a gift oh they left us 109 silver damn that's nice thank you i mean hey props to you oh we do have a little bit more granite blocks over there 47 more 
So that's good. So we can do that and that for support for now. So we can actually have a roof. Obviously, I mean, they're still going to complain about sleeping outside and all that stuff. But at least that's going to make it a little bit easier. Okay, so uh, we actually don't need to look for a name this time. Because we're obviously going to be the protect turret. Um, and, and we are going to be very, very, very good about our names. Uh, about the colonies. Uh, this is base one. <laughs> this is base one. That will be base two, base three, base four, and base five. And that's uh, just like how about how creative we're, that's that's how we creative we're going to get with this and that's it oh look at that sitting sitting on you know while eating we have we have achieved the optimum comfortable level uh, com comfort level he is gonna go get oh he's he's ooh, who insulted you oh boy who insulted you oh left compared larry to an ant oh that's rude that's rude. You don't do that. I mean, you just basically called him tiny. That's that's not very nice. That is not nice at all. So we're going to get that floor. Yeah, we're going to get this floor. And uh, we're going to smooth this uh, in here and all that stuff later on. That's just basically, basically the smoothing and stuff like that is just busy work for our construction person at the moment. Ooh! An excellent chair already. Sweet. What is the art? This furniture is engraved with an image of Lev Dernan deeply kissing Lucia David in an unrealistically large bed. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Lev is stylistically bonded with David. This illustration refers to Lev and Dev uh, David becoming lovers on the 12th of October. Oh, how adorable. She made it. She made a chair about their relationship. Oh, isn't that, isn't that just... That is that is quite adorable, actually. Okay, there's a mad hair. Time to miss it all with our lovely charge rifles, because that's just what's. Yep. Oh no, never mind. Never mind. There we go. We got one. Um, we're gonna put that over there. Oh, we do need to get a butcher table, don't we? So at least we can do some butchering for now. All right, we're gonna put the butchering table right there where you just put the silver. Um, that's that's not so good gonna remove these plants because we don't need them anymore because we know now what's going to go there so that's good the question is I really need to check is there anything that we would like to tame maybe butcher creature do forever we're gonna make the ingredient radius smaller though um, let's see I've got some llamas Ooh, llamas would be nice llamas are obviously also modded just like the chipmunks they're the, the tanagan hens the rat pandas the great bustards there's a lot of modded animals but the llamas are really cute and cute they're good to minus 28 i think we'll be fine so i will i would like female llama ah oh, we can't okay female llama uh, so we need to get something that we can tame. Maybe so we can we can level up our taming. Uh, can we do a turkey? Yes, we can do a turkey. All right, we're gonna train. We're gonna train our training. We're gonna train our animal training with trying to tame that. We're gonna try to tame a turkey. You're hauling to stockpile. Can you cut the berry bush? Because we kind of need some vegetables. There we go. Kind of need some vegetables or fruit rather, because you know berries are fruit, not vegetables. FG. In case I didn't know. Kind of need to do that. Um, there we go. I'm gonna mark some more berry bushes, because obviously we'll need fruit and slash vegetables for the llamas as well. And then we'll go from there. Um, how much do we have? 93 granite blocks. That's pretty good. So we'll do five here. And then we'll close it like that. And then we'll do a door there. That needs to get mined. And I need to check. I can mine out that bit though. So I can mine that bit out. And then we can put a wall bit here. And then we'll have a nice... We don't need, as I said, we, because we have the, the stacking mod. Or a stacking mod, I should say. Ooh, a roof has collapsed. Ooh, where? Oh, down here are the... No, the bugs are not doing anything silly right now. What are you trying to do? What are you trying to do? You're trying to tame a turkey by walking through there. Um Yeah, let's that's how about we don't do that? Let's that's good thing I saw that. Okay, manage area, new area. We're gonna call that uh no bugs. Um we're gonna do it like this. 
no bugs do not go through there um because obviously now we need to do this so switch them around so they go everywhere but there and then left should go the other way around why are we slowing why why are we slowed anybody in danger no why are we slow though that's weird why are we in <clears throat> why were we in slow force oh maybe because of the bugs but yeah we don't need to we don't need to attack these bugs at the moment that's they're gonna they're gonna become a problem sooner rather than later anyways so uh let's let's try to just avoid that for now okay 5.2 all right we'll get there we'll get there in the end we'll get there in the end i reckon how much how oh, yeah 34 berries so sweet all right we're gonna set this to obviously it doesn't need to be minus nine minus six degrees celsius is fine need to get some power production going we'll smooth that eventually we'll smooth the floor in there as well don't need to do that quite yet um where Ooh, if we if we wall this off here which we are going to be doing um we're gonna put our power generator here we can mine this bit out and have a gap in between for um just you know firefighting purposes and stuff like that we'll do it like this we'll do our wood fire generator like that and then we'll have just the power line run through here because obviously we can run it through walls and stuff we'll just do that something just got wrecked oh you got wrecked by a walk didn't you yep yep that walk went like i'm gonna eat you nom 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 that is exactly what it did okay let's go get this done and then we'll get this done enough stored i know oh we should have a door on this side as well though so we'll do a door here and we'll do a door there um here a door there a door everywhere a door door um oh we need to set the priority on this priority preferred so we actually put the corpses in there where you know well they'll be kept cold uh, and see, this is one one of the things that I was talking about. This is the animal variety coat that Cucumpere has made. Has made, made, made. Um, just different, you know, different bunnies. Bunnies have different colors and um, like other animals like camels and oh, or the dromedaries and stuff like that. They just all have slightly different, slightly different colors because, you know, they don't all look like exactly the same IRL as well. So there we are. Got... Our, our sort of room almost set up got a storage stock bar we, we're growing some rice and some hay for later on yeah i think i think this is going relatively okay for now thank you so much for watching everybody i do appreciate it if you're new here uh like and subscribe and i will see you next time bye everybody